What's going on guys? Welcome back to Make It or Break It Monday, the show that helps you get your head right so you can start your week right. Guys, I'm a little irritated today. I know I try to keep the energy high in the intro, but I am irritated today. Um, I'll tell you why. I got a couple people around me that are just making decisions uh, for, around short-term happiness that are completely against better judgment. And you got to figure out if it's even your place to say something sometimes. I mean, these are like friend of a friends that like you get introduced to and sometimes like people just have to like make their own decisions and figure out which, what's right and wrong. But I'll tell you one thing, when you make decisions based on short term happiness, that's not actually going to take you to actual fulfillment. So happiness is that feeling of being happy. Where instead, fulfillment is achieving one's desires. So that's why like when if you're given something versus earning something, like someone gives you a car or someone pays for you to go to college, aside instead of like you working and saving and then buying a car or same thing for school, and you just you feel more attached to it you feel a different type of feeling because you're the one who had to do the action to create the achievement to get the desire. And it's, I know it's rampant in our society today to focus on short-term things and flashy things. Um, I have a friend of a friend, a family friend, who recently purchased a very nice car and um, the maintenance on the car, the only way they can afford it, if anything happened to the car was to buy this maintenance plan. And if anything else happens outside of that, they can't take care of it. And it's just things like that where you know someone's not making a good decision. And when you really get caught up in short-term happiness, that feeling, more importantly, it's a fading feeling, right? Instead of the actual fulfillment, fulfillment keeps you, keeps you energized. It keeps you humble. It keeps you staying attached to that thing because all of the effort and work actually went into it. Another example is I got somebody who's uh, thinking about changing jobs again. And this person's going into work and uh, just not, not being, they don't feel happy. They literally told me, I do not feel happy at my job. I said, okay. Um, well, this is the second job you've had in a short period of time. You were obviously happy, happy when you took the job, had these different perks and different things that you enjoyed about it. And now you're not happy. And I told them that they're not happy and they're going to continue to want to go from job to job to job to job because they're searching for happiness and not fulfillment in what they actually do. When you feel fulfilled, it means you are fulfilling a purpose. When you have a short-term happiness goal of that fancy car, right? Then, yeah, it's fleeting and it goes away because you're not creating the fulfillment. And the fulfillment comes from having bigger goals outside of just material things. And, man, I'm just like, ah, I, just, I just feel it around me. And I'm obviously not trying to let it affect me, but I just want you guys to, like, see that this isn't something that's just abnormal. Like this happens all the time. This is also just like, think about like, why people say like, they're not happy on a Monday. Like to make it or break it Monday, the most important day to actually start your week and you got people that have a case of the Mondays. Or people who say, hey, thank God it's Friday. And why, why are you just not so busy that you don't even know what day it is anymore? Like. That's how it should be. You should be working so hard towards fulfillment of this higher purpose of what you wanna do in life that those little things or those moments that you're not happy, they're okay. Because there's not everything that you're gonna enjoy inside of a job. That's why it's a job. It's not like what defines you, right? It's a job. So when you, when you think about that, as long as that task get you towards the fulfillment that you want. Yes, I understand you don't want to do that paperwork. I understand that you don't want to do your expenses. I understand that you don't want to do whatever. But understand that as you don't have to be happy doing those things. But if you can know that 
those things will help you move towards what you really want to do and that what fulfills you that's what keeps you going that's what keeps you motivated and literally if you can take both those things and job and purpose and everything else and you put them all together and you get fulfillment out of both that that's literally the best thing that there can be right but that's not for everybody and for my friend it's definitely not for for what he's getting into and the next job or the next next job is not going to change that for him so understand that with all these other things that are around you Short-term happiness is just that, it's short-term, okay? It's fleeting. And just, if you guys can just think bigger for a moment this week, just try to think about like fulfillment and not happiness, you will help you redefine in your head the different tasks that you have to do on a daily basis. You will look at the work that you do differently. You will look at it differently because even though it may not be something that you actually enjoy, that you feel like that you're forced to do, first realize that you choose where to work. You choose what actions to take at home. You choose if you wanna eat healthy or go to the gym. You make all of these different types of decisions. No one else makes them for you. And if you wanna be fulfilled, whatever that fulfillment means for you, you have to do the piece, the action, to get the achievement to then have the desire, okay? So I know this is a little long-winded today, but I just like felt like I had to get this out to you guys because we're so caught up in the short term, so caught up in the short term. So try to focus on those different actions to move you towards fulfillment this week. Hope this helps, have a good week.